blockade runner. This ship is, I'm telling you, a must-have. Once you train into this thing, you're going to wonder how you survived without it. I had the Kaldari one just because uh, it looks cool. I think you can get a little bit more space out of the uh, Galante. But uh, yeah, looks pretty badass. Spins pretty good too. The fit is um, the fit is pretty simple, right? So this thing is fast, and you know you get interdiction nullified. So if you get into a bubble, you can just like you know turn that on and get out of it. Covert ops, so you get to fly around cloaked and all that. My usual fit comes with two expanded cargo holds to swap out with these inertial stabilizers, and then uh, also run an afterburner because you know if you have already used your nully then you can technically just you know drop out a cloak hit this um, afterburner and uh, go pretty quick obviously some skills that uh, help this you know your match 14 navigation invasive maneuvering any skill that will you know help the afterburner cloaking all that stuff the rigs I use uh, expanded uh, or medium cargo optimization twos just to get it to well, around 50, around 12,000. So I'll show you real quick. We'll take these uh, inert stabs off. You can throw these expanded cargos on. About 12.5 in the space here um, is what I'm running right now. I run passive tank um, and just, you know, to match whatever gate rat damage there is, just in case, you know, you get targeted up for that. It's about 135 <clears throat> million right now. But, uh, just a lot of space, you know, and some of the things you can do with this space is you could fit a, you can fit actually a Hulk and a skiff plus fit or fit and plus, uh, you know, ice fit. You can also fit a, uh, Tingu plus a skiff in here, or you can fit a Tingu and like a buzzard or expo exploration ship, whatever. It's, um, it's very versatile. I usually, uh, I usually, when I'm moving ships or whatever, I'm usually just wrapping them in a, in a, a blockade runner. Also, my uh, Sino Walt, my main Sino Walt uses, who uses a Falcon or, and or, uh, you know, Ventures. We'll throw a Falcon in here. Like, my normal Falcon fit is pretty damn simple. Like, this is my Falcon fit. Has absolutely nothing on it, right? No rigs, nothing. Because what I do is, I basically break this whole thing down every time and then shove it into this blockade runner and then travel it to wherever I need to pop a Sino and then uh, dock up and put the Falcon together, pop the Sino, and then put it all back in, you know? Because uh, the Falcon's great, it has covert ops, but it doesn't have a, a nullifier in case you have to go through bubbles. And there's a lot of systems up there that your corporation might be putting up bubbles, so you need to get past friendly bubbles. You don't want to, it sucks dying in a, in a friendly bubble, that's for damn sure. But yeah, I can't, <clears throat> I can't recommend this ship enough, right? I originally trained into this when I was still in high sec and just for like running stuff back and forth, going around and pick up modules, you know, whatever, especially if you're in null sec, you know, you can bring blue salvage out, you can bring overseer packages out of null, you can bring warfight out of null, you can just move your mining ships or your exploration ships or, you know, your Tingu, move your Tingu around a little bit, everything. 100%, this ship, everybody needs a blockade runner. Absolutely. I'll put the uh, I'll put my fit there in the uh, description so you can uh, kind of save it and if you haven't trained into one you know definitely uh, you should definitely be looking into it. Highly recommended. Give one little last little look at the uh, the fit. And most of the time I don't even like put inert stabs on. I leave them off because it's still fast enough without it, right? I mean, but let's go in here. Turn this after runner off. Your line time is still 5.25, and I'm not running any sort of navigation implants. If you did, you'd be even lower than that. With an art stabs, um, you'd be like three seconds on alignment. So I just usually leave these on because I usually just come out of the gate, you know, select the next gate, cloak up, and good to go. Anyway, just wanted to let you know my thoughts on the blockade runner. My favorite is the crane. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.